All right, here we have Roxy, who is an official LAFD canine. Mm -hmm. What is Roxy's role uh, with the uh, unit? She and I work with the FEMA team. Uh, she's a live human scent canine uh, search and rescue dog. Live human scent, like she's trained to be able to follow smells. Uh, she doesn't follow smells. She'll find live humans in a rubble pile, in a building, that kind of thing. Tell me about her story. Um, her story, she's actually a stray from up in Sacramento. She was found by um, a woman unfit for her home. She chased their chickens, so she was turned into the ASPCA. The foundation that I got her from is called the Search Dog Foundation. They have recruiters everywhere that look for dogs that don't necessarily have homes or places to go that would work well as search dogs. A recruiter found her at the ASPCA in Sacramento. They tested her real quick. They adopted her, brought her back to the facility at the time it was in Gilroy. They trained her up and they paired us together about a year and a half after that. So they look for different little markers, I guess, personality traits, uh, play drive, their footing, ability to bark, ability to stay with a person. At the end of the day, what they're really looking for is a toy as their reward to find a person. I do have to watch her weight because she has to be able to go up on rubble piles just like us. Climb. So we do this, uh, partially it's the uh, footing type stuff. Um, the rubble piles aren't always nice and flat like uh, our normal walking surfaces. So we'll uh, practice their footing and then when she does fall, we want her to keep her confidence level up so that she can continue on. She doesn't just get scared and jump off. So we'll do this for practice. Very good. <laughs> I was working an overtime day in the fire station and nearby, actually just one district over, a uh, building had a partial collapse in a uh, parking structure. So when the units got on scene, they saw about five cars that were crushed under a bunch of dirt and the rubble from the rooftop of the parking structure. They thought that there was possibly someone stuck in there. All of the employees of the building were accounted for, but there was one resident that was unaccounted for. So um, they just brought in uh, two of our dogs to come check it out. Roxy was one of them, especially since we were right next door. We did a quick search. No one ended up being found and they ended up finding that one resident. Um, but it was a really memorable moment for her. 